Good morning, for today's video, as a support worker, I will be doing a sleepover shift. Since most of the clients are living on their own to keep their independence, that's why they need a person to be with them overnight. And this is what you call sleepover shift. You will only be paid an allowance if you're gonna do a sleepover shift. Doing a sleepover shift, it's not for everybody. Kay others, maglisod sila utulog kung wala sila sa kugalingong balay. Usually, the following day, your shift will start at 7 o'clock in the morning. But there are some clients that they prefer to sleep in or wake up a little bit later. So you have to respect their choices. This is me getting ready for the day. Ako lang sa nihipuso na sleeping bag. This bag lives in my car. So whenever there will be an unplanned sleepover, at least I don't have to go home and get my things. Since doing this sleepover shift, I always have spare clothes in my car. Just in case. After I've put my things back in the car, I will be waiting for the second staff to come on and then we can get the client ready for the day. Working in this sector, you have to respect your client's decision and choices, keep their independence, and be an advocate. And that's all for today! Have a good day!